In a new report, police say golfer Tiger Woods was found asleep at the wheel before his DUI arrest yesterday. His car was found running with the brake lights on when officers approached the car. Now, the report also says breath and urine tests showed no alcohol in his system. The golfer says prescription drugs are to blame. In a statement, Woods said, quote, alcohol was not involved. I didn't realize the mix of medications had affected me so strongly. The 14-time major champion who had back surgery last month was arrested by Florida police early Monday morning. Manuel Bojorquez has more. In that statement released last night, Woods also apologized and took full responsibility for his actions. Now police here are expected to release the arrest report and possibly dash cam video later today. Those items could shed light on Woods' behavior during the arrest. Disheveled and unshaven, Tiger Woods' mugshot is a stark departure from his usual carefully crafted public image. The 41-year-old golfer, winner of 79 PGA Tour events, was arrested around 3 o'clock Monday morning, not far from a restaurant he owns and his estate. Wood said he cooperated with Jupiter Police. His life has been, you know, chaotic and, and difficult, I think, for several years. Golf World Editor-in-Chief Jaime Diaz says Woods hasn't been the same golfer since he crashed his SUV on Thanksgiving weekend 2009. Tiger's a guy that is in trouble and needs help. That accident, which happened outside his Orlando home, reportedly followed an argument with his wife over his infidelity. They eventually divorced and Woods sought treatment for sex addiction. It's hard to admit that I need help, but I do. Woods has not played on the PGA Tour in four months. Last one, a major title in 2008. In October, Woods told Charlie Rose his health, not his personal struggles, was to blame for his decline. I've had three back operations, yeah. and that's taken its toll on me. Yeah. You're and not the athlete that you physically. No, a torn Achilles through that right. time, a blown knee, uh, torn meniscus. So I've, I've gone through physically a lot. In April, Woods underwent another back operation, his fourth in three years. In a blog post on his website just last week, he said, I haven't felt this good in years. If Tiger were to play well again, I think most of the public would sort of overlook what just happened, and maybe that's what he's banking on. Even though police took Woods into custody around 3 a.m., he wasn't booked into the county jail until about 7 a.m. He was released four hours later without bail. Anne-Marie, Vlad, 